The Nigeria Customs Service Ogun One Area Command has intercepted vehicles containing huge amount of live ammunition concealed in bags of foreign rice at Tumulu Junction near Yewa North local government area. The control of customs and the command by Medele Makinde while parading the seized items said his men will continue to be alive to their duties and prevent illegal movement of firearms and other contrabands across the borders. Give us a news, Kazim Olawe reports. A few days after the acting Comptroller General of the Nigeria Customs Service, Bashir Adeni visited the Ogunwan Area Command at Idi Iroko, where he warned officers against compromise at borders and urged them to ensure prevention of illegal movement of firearms across the borders. Officers of the Nigeria Customs Service Ogunwan Area Command have intercepted large amounts of live cartridges concealed in bags of foreign rice, abandoned in a bush path at Tombolo Junction near Yiwa North local government. While briefing journalists about the achievements of the command, the controller said the driver of the vehicles were suspected to have been informed about the movement of the custom operatives and they decided to abandon their vehicles and escape through the bush path in order to evade arrest. About 1,245 rounds of 17 millimeter to three quarter ammunition of Lion Trust, Supreme and Red Star branded cartridges were found to have been indigenously concealed in 20 bags of the intercepted foreign rice. While considering the potential danger of the ammunition of such magnitude, if successfully smuggled in, we redouble our efforts to ensure they do not find their way into the country. It is a threat to the safety of the border communities and national security. The distributed value of the seized ammunition and rice is 17 million. 638,145,000. The Comptroller who commended the Acting Comptroller General of Customs for his support and motivation promised that his officers will not leave any stone unturned in ensuring that the country's borders are well protected. Our Acting Comptroller General promised us, apart from the matching order, I thought he gave us a week. Yes, sir. He mandated us that he's given us just one week to make sure that um, we have something on ground. We are committed to ensuring maximum security of our borderlines with all sense of patriotism. The controller also appreciates the support of stakeholders in the state and urge them to continue to do more, especially in the area of information. Kazimolowe, TVC News, Abe Okuta.